he is the I greatest of all name, time. Man. Muhammad Ali. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, here. Welcome inside this unique. These two fighters promised us an offensive show. Let's see if they deliver. A counter shot lands. This fighter has not shown us much defense at all. They exchange punches. Miss with that jab. Good counter punching from both these fighters. Nice counter. This is a high octane battle. Good left counter that lands. Fantastic punch. Through the hook, didn't land. Some nice exchanges from both men in this yeah. ring. No rest for the weary. <laughs> Neither fighter willing to slow down. <laughs> He fails to score with that left hook. And just as quickly as it slows down, it heats back up. And it appears the onslaught is over, at least for now. Good idea, but misses with the left hook. Come on, Very buddy. Close round with 10 seconds to go. Come on, buddy. Talk yeah, about the greatest. Like that Talk about good. a one-sided three minutes. Good we just saw it. So they again. don't get complacent. Don't they think this is too here. easy. If they keep this same kind of pace up, here. they've got this crowd. Here's the bell for round two. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Positives and negatives in the heavyweight division are the same. You can win the fight with one punch, and you can lose the fight in one punch. I've seen it so many times. One punch changes everything. I've seen guys winning hands down. They decide to show by show off them. Bam! It's over. But they've got to stay sharp. One punch changes everything. Nice counter shot with the right hand. Nobody home with that hook. Left counter was perfectly timed. Both men step back for just a moment. <laughs> nice exchanges from both men in this round. You hear people talk about a boxer's chin. Do they have a good chin? Do they have a glass jaw? Those are questions that are being answered here tonight. Work the body, frustrate them, take the mind off the chin, take the mind off the chin, everything around that. Work the body, use tactics sometimes it's so hard to actually outbox a fight and beat them on points. Because you've got a good chin doesn't mean you've got leather skin, it means you can still get caught. So you've got to go for those point areas over the eyebrow, the cheekbone, you just got to try and cut them skimming, go for speed. Neither fighter willing to sit down on these punches. They're arm punches, they're scoring, but they're not gonna hurt anybody. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Let's talk about the greats. And there's the bell for round three. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Someone's will will cave, but which fighter will it be? Good 
counter punch. Talk about punches and bunches. That's the mantra for this fighter with that exceptional hand speed. This can be so frustrating. When you're in such a fast fight, a fast fight at the throw, three, four shot combinations before you've even let one up. That creates frustration, and that's when it gets hard. You got out of the way that right hook. Just when you think they're gonna have a lull in the action, we get it heated back up. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's gonna be a hard night tonight for the judges. <laughs> he gets out of the way of that left hand. They call it the chin. How strong is your chin? Do you have a glass chin? These are things that can affect the fight. I've seen some fights with a granite chin. You could hit them with a sledgehammer. They are not going to move. But then I've seen some mad punches with a chin like this. As soon as you touch them, they're gone. And this is the dangerous part. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Great. Well, we know they've got the advantage so far, but how does this match get turned around? Dominance, without a doubt, Meg looks so, so easy. Meg, he's gone. I'm telling you, he's gone. Jump on behind the jab and then let you shot. And there's the bell to start round four. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. <laughs> they are not going to let this one go to the judges. <laughs> Catch and shoot with the left counter. Good job. Perfect counter shot. Nothing but air on that hook. <laughs> Just when you think they're going to have a lull in the action, we get it heated back up. <laughs> is no matter how much speed you've got timing beats speed having so Ooh. much speed what happens to your opponent is you get cut the ribbons and that's Ooh. where the referee has to jump in and stop the fight and you know this is gonna happen so you rush your work you think i've got to get him inside close round nice exchanges from both men in this round very close match it shows the skill the discipline the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn been a very competitive round between these two. <laughs> Looking to land the hook. <laughs> One moment. I know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. <laughs> Let's talk nice about round. the greatest. Good round. I like that. I'm happy. There we go in round five. Who's going to land the first big shot? Well, there's no <laughs> doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Being shown here is just incredible. Oh, yeah. oh come on, John, Dave. Back out of trouble. <laughs> You've heard the phrase finding a second come on, win. Buddy. I don't think I need to tell you which one of these fighters needs to find. Come on, what come in here and find can out. They oh, fuck. Down? Can they hope to, to, to knock them out early? What can we do? They've got to concentrate and relax. Because you know what you can do in the gym, you can do it in a fight. They've got to relax. He 
heard the phrase, finding a second win. I don't think I need to tell you which one of these fighters needs to fight. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Oh. Oh, oh. He just misses with that jab. Mm. Mm. By the way, the connect percentages have to be off the charts. Fighter willing to slow down. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Nice offensive display landing that left counter. Let's talk about the greatest. Pretty duffel. There's the bell to start round six. Coming off that fantastic last round, let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Is this the beginning of the end for Muhammad Ali? Disaster. I don't think it's going to be a boxing match. This is going to be a fight. And it appears they weathered the storm. How? I'm not sure. <laughs> I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. When you've got a fast fighter, they will cut you to ribbons. And they know it's a matter of time before either you get desperate or the referee jumps in and saves you. This is a natural gift. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. How did he absorb that hook? Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Perfect counter lands. And it appears the onslaught is over, at least for now. Caution being thrown to the wind. Do you believe what we're seeing? Good counter punching for both these athletes. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. about the great. I love that. I love that. That chap. And there's the bell for round seven. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Left counter score. Nice counter punch. How much confidence do you build when your opponents hit you with their best shot and you walk right through it? What a gift. What a gift it is to have a chin where you know you can walk through anything and everything. When you let those shots go and it's just bouncing off and they're walking you down, it's so demoralizing. It absolutely breaks your heart. What else can you do? You hear people talk about a boxer's chin. Do they have a good chin? Do they have a glass jaw? Those are questions that are being answered here tonight. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. We'd like to see this fighter protect themselves a little better. Both men step back for just a moment. There's a big difference between being the aggressor and the effective aggressor. Which type are we seeing so far? Sometimes when you have a fight, the best way to beat a fight is not give them what they want. Because they want to get you there. They want you to stand there, toe to toe with them, and have a tail. That's what they do in the gym every single day of the week. What you've got to do is you've got to frustrate them as they set their shots. 
Get out of the way. And they'll get so angry, so frustrated because they can't work. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Let's talk Look about the group. Absolutely. Back. And we enter the eighth round. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. With counter punching. And finally, Muhammad Ali goes down. One, two, three. They're back up on their feet, but I'm not sure why. You couldn't write a script like this. This is like Rocky versus Apollo. Whoa, wait a minute. What a shot. <laughs> Disaster averted. <laughs> oh, and they just got their bell rung. <laughs> Is this the beginning of the end for Muhammad Ali? <laughs> I thought that was the end, but here we go again. Back into the fire. <sighs> Left hand misses. <laughs> oh, that punch. <laughs> nice job. The final 10 seconds of the round, and he is looking really sharp. about the ground. Come on. And we enter the night. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting... that this fighter possesses, how do you deal with it? You've got to ruffle their feathers, Todd. You cannot let them get comfortable. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, they're back up on their feet, but I'm not sure why. Somebody can smell blood here. They can smell blood. They've got to be smart. Get in there. Then boom. Back in the same spot again. If it happened once, you've got to wait Come on, it. buddy. It Come on, buddy. Come at me. How about that will to win and refusal to stay down as this fight continues? with the right counter. Not many of the people in the division hit like them. Nice counter shot. <laughs> Looks like he's gonna survive the round here, but just barely. <laughs> Let's talk yeah, about the boy, greats. I love that. I love that. That chap. This is the tenth. It's been a nightmare so far. What can they do to turn this around? I have no idea what they have left. What? How? How do you come back from something like that? Not like twice? How, where's your head at? Where's your energy levels at? It tells you you've got nothing left. That left counterpunch will score. <laughs> 
Endurance is becoming a factor. You can see this fighter having a hard time getting out of the way of the punches, and they're not throwing as many on their own. Now this is about desire. This is about character. This is about want. Swing and a miss with that left hook. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. In the early rounds of a fight, you'll see two boxers feel each other out, test each other's power, and I think this boxer has decided I can walk through anything that lands. Hard. You know what? Sometimes when I'm going in the ring with fights like that and you punch them, you just want to run. You want that spaceship to come and lift you out of there because you think, what the hell am I going to do now? This is when you get in the ring feeling like you're King Kong because you know you've got a chin that is not going to get dented. He misses with that jab. Catch and shoot. You can tell he's strong. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. There's a counter shot. Ooh. Let's talk That's about the greatest. Good round, right? That's okay. There's the bell for round 11. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Great counter right hand there. Left hook miss. Yeah. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong, but when you're dealing with someone with so much speed, you've got to get your timing right. What you gotta to do, Tony, is anticipation. You've gotta wait, you've gotta you just gotta throw caution to the wind and just hope you're never gonna know where the shots are coming from. You just gotta put in a guess. This fighter is sort of the death by a thousand paper cuts approach. He'll hit you a thousand times before you can land one. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. That punch lands. Both men step back for just a moment. Beautiful counter shot. One of the best attributes to have in boxing has nothing to do with boxing. It's how well you can take a punch to the face. Problem with having a chin that everybody knows if they hit you, you're hurt, you're gone. You've got to protect that, but you've also got to get your shots off. And they forget, you can bang too. Left punch. Very competitive round with 10 seconds left. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Well, he's got enough, and he is going to quit. So they were throwing the towel, the corner has stopped. Oh man, I beat his ass. <laughs>